Okay, then moving to the next presentation. This is from Jollywood, uh, which is not only a leading module maker, but also a leading backsheet supplier. So bringing the expertise from both the ends, Frank Wong, product manager at Jollywood, is going to present uh, transparent backsheets and prospective future. Thank you. The floor Hi. is yours. Hi, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Give me one second. Yeah. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, it is an honor to have the opportunity to address such distinguished audience. Thank you all for coming to Jordan Wood's presentation. And I'm Paige Yu Wang. Uh, the product manager at Jolly Woods, and I appreciate that Town News give us the chance to introduce our uh, product here. And it is my uh, pleasure to uh, represent our company to share our latest uh, products. And today, my presentation is divided to four main sections. So, firstly, it is a brief introduction to our company. And secondly, it is a product overview. And thirdly, it will be the superiority of the products. Finally, it will be a short uh, summary. So now let's get started. So our company, Jolly Woods, uh, was established in 2008. And at that time, we focused on making backsheet and other PV materials. Uh, since 2016, we have been manufacturing solar panels. And uh, from the beginning of manufacturing solar panels, we just focus on uh, producing the NTAP Topcon uh, modules, which just became uh, famous last year. And that proves the far side of the company. And we also accelerate a lot of experience during the seven years of production. And by the end of last year, the capacity of Topcon uh, modules has already become uh, 7.6 gigawatts. And as predicted, the, the data will reach more than 10 gigawatts by the end of this year. So we have enough ability to provide high quality solar panels to all of our uh, clients. And we have more than 1,000 business partners worldwide. And the business footprint has covered uh, 60 uh, countries and regions. So I'm grateful for their recognition and support. We will uh, provide stable service persistently as a reward. So as a pioneer of uh, untapped top con technology, Jolly Wood has broken the cell efficiency record a few times. And the latest record is 26.7% which has still been kept by Jolly Wood uh, since uh, this April. So we have gained the uh, shop performance price uh, granted by PBL by 2021-2022. And because of timeline, this page hasn't been updated to the latest stage, but the score record was released by PBL on uh, May 22nd. And it is the achievement that requires the solar panels to pass a series of uh, severe tests. These tests are much more severe than the requirement of the IC standard. So it is an evidence of Jolly Wood product stability. Now let's get into the uh, product overview of uh, So in recent years, by official large size, high frequency, and low level life cost of uh, economy. These four factors of module uh, products are becoming more trendy. So this is on to developing the fast technical breakthrough in solar cells. But some problems are accompanied by and avoidably the high wage cumbersome in transportation and installation difficulty in cleaning are more and more troublesome. These three questions annoy manufacturers and users. So based on the background, Joy Wu will release a new uh, product, 
transparent backsheet uh, bifacial modules. So the new product will have the same strong performance as Jordan Wu's previous product. So the mass production efficiency breaks through 25.2%, and it has a lower degradation, merely 1% for the first year and 0.4% for the following years until the 30th year. And the temperature coefficient of Pmax is also uh, lower than PERCH. It's only minus 0.3% uh, per Celsius. And the power gain will be 1% to 2% more in high temperature region compared with the P-type. So what is the price wars for the coming product? So as known, Jolly Wood was not only a good solar module manufacturer, but also the top three uh, company of backsheet materials in the world. We develop a new technology called Hobart. So uh, it has a three layer structure. The, stru uh, the structure is as shown in the picture. And the microwave curing process is adopted to form a dense alloy. A protective layer, thus becoming the transparent armor layer of the back sheet. So let's compare the two kinds of products. So uh, I will call transparent back sheet uh, TV products in short and the double glass modules DG uh, product in short. And uh, the sides are totally the same and they look very similar. The only difference between the double glass uh, module and the TB module is uh, glass thickness. Any other materials are totally the same. And the transparent backsheet by official module also have a 30 years of uh, linear power warranty as long as the biofacial uh, double glass modules. So why choose Jodowu's transparent biofacial product? And here are the advantages that a double glass modules doesn't have. So point one is uh, the lightweight. So compared with the DG modules, the weight of TB modules is 17% lighter and it reduces the difficulty in transportation and installation. And less use of breakage will bring along the cost input reduction which is benefit to the investor and our clients. And point two is uh, a high light transmittance. So enter the light wavelengths of 400 to 1,100 nanometers. The light transmittance of transparent backsheet exceeds 90%, 94%, which is better than the backlash of the double glass module. So even after the damage and the ultraviolet test, the performance of the transparent back sheet is better than glass. The large transmitters still exceed 93%. And the transparent back sheet has self-cleaning properties due to its original uh, intention of design and structure. So compared with the transparent back sheet, the glass doesn't have that characteristic. It is easily uh, contaminated uh, with dust. And dust, as know, will influence the power generation a lot, especially after the plant operated for several years. And in summary, our new uh, product will have our clients to get more power gain and let their plants have a long-term warranty in safety from the material, stru uh, material structure design. So we have already talked about the three advantages of our new product, lighter weight, so high light transmitters and self-cleaning ability. So someone may have adopted uh, from the technical aspect and could the product have a good performance during the long-term use and how is its uh, long-term reliability? How is its waterproof capability? And other people may have adopted uh, about its benefit to their product. So there are two diagrams in this page 
On the left, it is the result of the ultraviolet test. And on the right, it is the result of the damp heat test. So they show a comparison between the TV product and the module with the white black sheet. So the ultraviolet test and damp heat test are used to simulate a long-term uh, operating environment. So under the both test, the TB modules uh, reviews excellent long-term reliability. So except for the uh, normal transparent back sheet, we also release the transparent back sheet with a, a layer of bridge, which could increase a five more watts for each piece of modules. It is an extra option for the clients who wants to increase the power uh, from the front side. Now let's do an uh, income analysis. So we have already had an outdoor empirical comparison. So the project is based in Ningxia province, which is a core position at the most extensive photovoltaic uh, concentration, concentration area in China. And this area of uh, this area is of the temperature contaminational climate, and it is always dry heat with a large temperature difference. The attitude is about one thousand and one hundred meters. So, it is a solar energy resource class one area. The solar spectrum is uh, close to the standard EM one point five. And the duration with the added irradiation intensity of 500 watts per meter square and above is more than 2,000 hours. The daily average direct irradiation amount is 1.75 uh, kilowatts hours per meter square, and the ultraviolet component is high. So we chose two days of different weathers. April 18th. It is a sunny day, and April 27th, it is a cloudy day. So these two diagrams show the operating temperature uh, comparison between the TV modules and the DD modules. The horizontal axis represent the time in one day, and the uh, vertical axis represent the operating temperature. So look at the below form, it implies the difference of uh, DG products operating temperature minus that of TB modules. So we can see that the maximum temperature difference is uh, 2.25 Celsius, which is in the quality day. And the uh, less average temperature difference of module is 1.13 uh, Celsius, which is in the standard day. So as you know, under the same temperature coefficient, the product with the lower operating temperature will have more electrical generation. So in this page, it shows the uh, it shows a uh, the uh, empirical comparison uh, in almost one years. So the horizontal. Uh, Horizontal axis represent the different months, and the vertical axis represent the uh, power generation. And uh, the green bar is the data of uh, double glass module, and the yellow bar is the data of the TB modules. So after the calculation, we can draw the conclusion that the average power generation of transparent back sheet modules increased by uh, one point. Two nine percent. So that is a very huge uh, income. Uh, and let's do an assumption. So it is a one hundred megawatts uh, product, which is DG product in Guangdong. Let's suppose the product is transparent backsheet uh, product, and I you know the Guangdong photovoltaic electricity price is zero point five. Uh, yuan per kilowatt hour, the energy yield gain will be uh, 1.29 percent as calculation mentioned above. And after 30 years, the total income will be uh, 18 million yuan. 
which is about 2.5 uh, million euros. That is a very huge extra income. And based on uh, 30 years of uh, system income, which equivalent to a system cost reduction of 0.18 yuan per watt, which is about uh, 0.025 euros per watt. So I know, of course, it's just an assumption. The actual situation will be more uh, sophisticated and the income could be calculated so simply, but it still shows an potential uh, poss poss possibility. So finally, let's do a uh, brief uh, summary. So our new products, transparent backsheet products, have five superiorities. The first point is a lighter weight. Uh, the weight of the module is 17% lighter, and uh, it is easy for transportation and in installation. Last use bracket will be a uh, benefit to the investors. And the point two is a uh, high light transmittance. So enter the same sunshine and using the same area of line uh, ground, uh, it will generate more value for our clients. So that's what same sunshine more value means. And uh, point three is uh, soft cleaning ability. So there will be no dust on the uh, back and it reduces the uh, effect and influence of the horse board and something like that. So it keeps the safety warranty for our clients. And the fourth superiority is the long-term reliability. So it passed the uh, uh, damp heat test and the ultra wetland test. And also it has a 30 years linear warranty as long as the, the uh, DG product. And last but not at least, the, uh, the power generation will, uh, will be 1.29% uh, higher. That will give our clients and investors more income. And uh, after the uh, assumption, uh, it will give the, our clients a system cost reduction of 0.025 euros per watt. So, that's what I'm going to talk about today and uh, introducing our company, introducing the transparent batch uh, product and finally providing another choice for uh, our audience. So thank you all for listening. So. Okay, thank you very much, Frank. So, uh, you know, you know, transparent back sheet uh, always bring this uh, topic of, uh, you know, reliability on, how it can really resist the bad climate and, and environment onto the table. So can you provide a little, uh, you know, in two, three sentences about the, the reliability, you know, how it can, uh, uh, you know, prevent fire, corrosion and all this. So a little more than what you said just now. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, that's a good question. Uh, so, uh, at first, I have to talk about the fireproof. So we have already uh, qualified with the IC six one seven third three zero certificate. So that proof our new product has passed the safety standards, and actually it reduces the operating temperature as mentioned above, which will reduce the risk of uh, ignition to an accident. And to talk about the uh, dust uh, resistance. So uh, there are three layers of the back sheet as mentioned. Uh, the air layer is a dense alloy protective layer that's becoming the transparent uh, armor layer of the back sheet. And besides that, our new product has the IC6006H-2, uh, which is a, a dust resistant test standard. Uh, finally, to talk about the corrosion, so our product has already passed the IC61701 and IC62716, which are salt mist and uh, um, an ammonia gas uh, test standards. So only if the product is used on the sea directly with no immersed risk, uh, all of the product will be 
all right, I think. So that's it, yeah. Right, uh, that's very interesting. So uh, I think that we, there are a few other questions also in the in the chat back uh, uh, our chat uh, chat box, um, especially from our colleagues uh, from India. Would be great if you can stay along with us and enjoy the conference. So meanwhile, please try to answer the questions in the chat window. Yeah, sure. I will answer the question in the chat box. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.